Welcome to this exam preparation video where I'll show you how to answer a question on water potential. This question asks about preparing cells for viewing with a light microscope. It says the scientists place the cells into a high water potential solution. Not high enough to burst the cells but enough to help move the chromosomes inside it further apart so they could be seen without overlapping each other. We have to suggest how this procedure helps move the chromosomes apart. Now, at first glance, this may seem like an impossible question. How on earth are we supposed to know? That's often the way with these suggest type questions. The trick is to reread the question and use what they give you. The cells are placed into a slightly higher water potential solution. What's going to happen to these cells? Let's look at this diagram to remind ourselves. With a higher water potential outside the cell, water will enter via osmosis. The cell will increase in volume and depending on how much higher the water potential is outside may continue swelling until it bursts. However, we're told that the cell did not burst. The water potential outside was only slightly higher than inside. So in this case, the cell will increase in volume but not to the point where it bursts. But because the cell is now larger than it was, everything inside has more space to spread out. So now we have our answer. Placing the cells into a higher water potential causes water to enter the cell via osmosis. This causes the cell to increase in volume, allowing the chromosomes to move further apart. Don't forget, you're told in the question that the cells are placed into a higher water potential and that chromosomes move further apart. So the marks are coming from you knowing the process of osmosis which causes the cell to swell. So that's it for now. Make sure you click the thumbs up and subscribe for future videos like this. Follow me on various social media for latest news or revision tips. Good luck with your revision and take care. Bye bye.